Well, this is the first time that we've heard from NASA astronauts Butch Wilmore and Sonny Williams since NASA made the decision to send their spaceship, Starliner, back to Earth without them. The mission's commander, Butch Wilmore, who's also a Navy test pilot, said that, you know, you don't want to see your ship go off without you. But he also said that he understood NASA's decision. When you have uh, an issues like we've had, there's some changes that need to be made. Uh, Boeing's on board with that. We're all on board with that. And I can tell you, um, when you push the edge of the envelope again and you do things with spacecraft that have never been done before, just like Starliner, you're going to find some things. And in this case, we found some things that we just could not get comfortable with uh, putting us back in the Starliner when we had other options. And that other option is a SpaceX Crew Dragon, which means that Butch and Sonny won't be returning to Earth until February of 2025. So I asked them, you know, what has it been like for you mentally to go from a roughly eight-day mission to an eight-month mission? Here's what they said. The things that I can't control, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna fret over it. I mean, there's, there's no benefit to it at all. There's nothing we can do. There's nothing we can do. So we march forward. I have to say, though, in the back of my mind, you know, there's there's folks on the ground who had some plans, right? Like, um, you know, like my family and um, so to spend some time with my mom. And I think I was fretting more about that, like the things that we had sort of all talked about and planned for this fall and this winter. Um, and I think I was a little bit nervous, to be honest with you, to say, like, OK, I'm not coming home for it. But you know what? Like like we both mentioned in the very beginning, everybody, you know, was on board. The other thing that they will be missing while they are in space is the election. And today, Butch Wilmore said that he put in his request for a ballot. Butch and Sonny will be voting remotely from the International Space Station. Kristen Fisher, CNN, Washington.